Hello there, YouTube. Tilly Winks is here. Are you part of America's laziness problem? You just may be. So, I got basically the unemployment thing and all that because my job didn't have me employed for a good eight weeks because of the COVID-19 thing. So I was making 850 or 875 or whatever it is a week. I got the federal and the state unemployment. Now, the problem with that is, is you got people that make normally 250 a week that are getting the 875 a week all of a sudden and they don't want to go back to work. Well, I only make like 650 a week, so I would have made more if I would have stayed on the unemployment. But I worry about later on if I can told my boss, no, I'm not going to come to work. Am I going to have a job? You know, I, I have five people. I have three kids and my wife and I to take care of. So, you know, I have to constantly have money. Um, I know the law is that you have to go back to work if your boss asks you to right now or they will cut your unemployment. Well, I went ahead and told my boss I'd come back to work, so I'm making less money right now than I would have on unemployment, and I still could have wrote it out until July. So, um, are you part of the laziness problem in America? You know, if you're going ahead and telling your job that you ain't going to come back, that's what's going to kill our economy. See, after this COVID-19 scare, they gave away all this stimulus money and this unemployment and stuff. And they thought that was going to stimulate the economy because people were going to go out and spend a bunch of money. But the thing is, is instead of spending it, people start saving it because they realize after the last crisis with the COVID-19, after they got furloughed from their jobs they had no money in savings everybody lives pay, pay, paycheck to paycheck you know I think it's 25 to 50 percent I can't remember which one it is of Americans live paycheck to paycheck so people start becoming aware all of a sudden hey I need to have a little bit put away so put the money away and uh, they went ahead and did that instead of spending it so the economy's kind of like eh, teeter-tottering we don't know what's going on with it what's going to help is when people have their little bit of money put away and they actually go back to work and they start spending it and they don't have suspended bills and all that anymore that'll get the economy going again so basically what i'm saying is if you've told your job you ain't coming back because you're making more on unemployment, shame on you. I mean, I get that you need the money, oh yeah, but it's not always gonna be there and you can't count on it. You know, I would much rather work my butt off to take care of my family and it be my hard work that builds my family, my retirement, my home, my castle, that pays my bills than the government doing it for me. Because the government doing it for me is socialism. And we know that that does not work well. And it especially will not work in America. So go back to work, people. Unless you're disabled, go back to work. Tilly Winks is signing out. Rate, comment, subscribe. I'm out.